Dave Splur Nation. Nice. Hello, I'm David and today I'll be breaking down this shot. Open up a 3D editing program and apply your footage as a backdrop. This can be used as a reference to create a box that matches the ground. For the surface, use a projection map to texture the box. Shooting your footage at 4K can help it keep all of the details. If you want your chunk of rock to be thicker, create a second box underneath for more volume. The material we apply to this will use textures in the concrete section from Graphics Crate. Use a fracture script to break the box into as many pieces as possible. A gravity force with a very small radius can then pull the fragments that are near the centre. Using glue constraints in the simulation will help the rock look chunky and natural. Since we want the rocks to fly away, a second force is activated at the right moment. It can be tricky to set up, but once you're happy with it, get it rendered. Open After Effects or any editing program and overlay the ground burst to your footage. I went over to Footage Crate to download Smoke Puffs and Shock Waves. These bring a lot more realism and require only a moment to set up. Our final step will be using the Camera Shake script to bring life to your footage. That wraps up everything. All of the content we used is in the description. Let us know if you have any ideas for another project. Thank you for watching.